Hits, hits, hits. Halloween spectacular, a very fun show. Uh, opened up great Halloween graphics throughout the show. Uh, opened with gun show, Brett Michaels, and it coming out in a Jason mask against Bull Bronson. Bull's been around this area for a long time. Good, solid match, quick match. Uh, he pretty much said, gun show said that he will be taking care of business next week. Taking care of business next week. We had a posse vignette where it looked like Lance was having second thoughts about being with the posse. Now, if you've been with the posse, either you're riding down the road with them or you're fighting with them or whatever you're doing with them, let me tell you, you always have second thoughts when you're with the posse, and it seems like that's what's happening with Lance uh, in this segment. We have Cassandra and MKZ backstage talking. Uh, then we had a trick-or-treat triple threat. That's trick-or-treat triple threat. Dustin, why'd you do that? Uh, Nick's XS, I never get her name right, against Bashley Bones and Cassandra. Very good match. Cassandra looked really good. Finished it with the golden rings. Uh, and Maria had something, a really good comment here, and I did not gather what she was talking about. But I think she told Dustin she was going to bust his ass. So I, I, I really, I think that's what she said. As I said, Cassandra looked fantastic. Uh, we see someone walking around an old house. We find out it's cruel. Uh, it's man, it, it just looked real spooky there. Uh, it was a big street fight uh, tomorrow. A big street fight tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. As we have K Tumor. And Mike Anthony talking about what's going on. And Mike said, Mike said, this was the plan the whole time. That's right. Mike Anthony had planned to turn against K Tumor the whole time. Did I mention Terrence Ward was on the show? We actually talked about this. And Mike actually turned in. So, so listen to that episode. They showed the flex uh, nearly getting run over by a car in a parking lot. We had the Tim Grind interview. Uh, ended up, uh, he said, flex will be here next week. Flex will be here next week. Mr. Chris, from behind, jumped Tim Grind, and they were beating up Tim Grind. And Lance, they were asking Lance to, to poke Tim in the face or uh, in the eye with one of those spikes, or they was going to have him hit him with the chair. Uh, he looked at him and said, don't do it. He got in front of little Chris to save his dad, and then they grabbed him. Uh, little Chris grabbed Lance, and Simon turned around and threw fire. That's right, he threw fire, but it didn't hit Lance. It hit Mr. Chris, so it looks like Lance is going back with his dad. A big belated happy birthday to Dustin. Good segment there. Uh, and when they come back, Simon's kind of going crazy everywhere in the studio. Uh, he's he's not really going over to little Chris, but you can tell. You can tell that he's real upset. Uh, videos. We have VIP with Gangrel, Kevin Thorne, or Kevin Seven, Crazy Steve. Looked really good. Huge crowd. Then we got to see Jeff Jarrett Media Day. If you're on the Patreon. Terrence Ward talked about this. Uh, we then had BJD talk about uh, being recruited by by righteous, the Righteous Path, and he said, "Hell no!" And he tore up the pant. Wait, the pamphlet? He tore. Up wait, what? What? Oh, uh, tore up the pamphlet, and uh, then Reverend S. Taylor. Uh, actually challenged him but they ended up ryan and brother bruce that's triple r to everyone else and brother bruce uh jumped uh bjd and then the druids is what they called them the druids come out uh maria was so good here she acted real scared very good uh and they carried out uh bjd there so it'll be interesting to see what goes on there we had some clips from the Halloween contest. That's right. And, guys, this is why their fan base is so good. They do so well with the community and their crowd. All right. Then we had the main event, the Monster Brawl. 
Battle Royal. That's a mouthful, too. There was all kinds of stuff going on here. We had Barmas, as he said, he promised the L.A. Hustlers the main event. They were in there. We had the debut of a few brand new people. Uh, we had the return. And if you haven't watched it yet, I, I don't really want to spoil it with you for you, but there is a return there. Uh, we had, and, and uh, Maria actually yelled, hell has frozen over. Absolutely loved it. Uh, Cruel came out last and destroyed the, everyone and ended up winning the battle royal. We had Gangrel. We had Kevin Seven. We had Crazy Steve in a fork. Um, everything, everything. Uh, and it was one funny hit there was when Mikey pulled down his straps and she said, who's he trying to be, Jerry Lawler? And uh, Dustin said, can you say that? And Maria said, I can say whatever the hell I want to. So there you go. She can say whatever the hell she wants to. Fun, fun battle roll. If you're into battle rolls, that was our hits, our hits for week 140. Of the Monster Brawl Battle Royal, the monster, the atrocity, cruel. Ladies and gentlemen, we're all out of time on today's Halloween spooktacular. What a hell of a monster brawl, Battle Royal, and there's your winner. I am Dustin Starr. She's my Maria. Saying so long, everybody. Macho Maria. And happy Halloween.